Okay, we start, uh, we start the show. It's uh, 10.20, 20 minutes late. And first session, uh, I will hold it and uh, I will be supported by some week later on in the session. First of all, uh, let me all welcome you very warmly here in Lucerne. Uh, it's the first ever international QA show in Switzerland. And uh, I welcome all the QLers. I see many of you. Some of them I not seen for more than 10 years. Also Mackers, uh, we have Ruben here. And also guests, as I uh, thought we maybe have some guests and by coincidence one made it. So uh, you're welcome. And uh, I must uh, switch uh, to the email shortly to uh, tell you some additional story about the welcome. We will have more people here. Uh, at the show, there will be Tony Fierschman and Simon Goodwin. They are on the way. They wrote me this uh, morning that uh, it will be around 11 when they will be here. So they are with the car from Geneva. And uh, I'm uh, waiting for their story. Right hand driving, Switzerland. <laughs> That's maybe funny. Maybe uh, you know them. They always get in trouble sometimes. <laughs> then uh, we have uh, Marcel and uh, Marcel Kilkus. He wrote me an email at uh, half past midnight that he's still on his on the preparation of his session. And all of uh, you who, who know Marcel, he never did a session before. And uh, it was really uh, very tricky to get him to the point to do a session, and he took one day off from work to prepare it. And I know him, once he starts on something, he goes deep into it, and it was one in the night. And he mentions that at 6 o'clock he wants to get wake up and start driving from Germany. And uh, I, I wake up at 6 this morning as well and wrote him an email and say, OK, we go now for the setup. And he said, said now I start with the car. <laughs> and uh, what he said, I translated, oh God, I could get more sleep. And I uh, wrote him an SMS and say, give me a ring when you're near. And uh, we got the message that he should be here right now. So hello, Marcel <laughs> is maybe at the parking lot. OK, to close uh, the story, there are people, there were people invited who uh, are not able to come. QLers, I have a warm welcome from uh, Jim from the US. Because uh, I've been a lot in the US at US shows, and I invited him personally, but he cannot make it. Then also uh, the, the Spanish crew, you know, all the who are very active with their Q-Block and so on, they send a warm welcome. Then the Quanta committee members, uh, except Dilwin, send a warm welcome, are not able to come, and many others. And also I'm in contact with the QL designers. And uh, Mrs. Uh, Jones wrote me an email late at night yesterday. And she promised me something which I wanted to show today, but she was too busy last week. So I'll get on this next week, but that's too late for the show. <laughs> but that's good for the QL users mailing list and for the magazines and for YouTube and my stuff to publish it later on. Okay. Then Welcome QLers, that's a picture five years ago uh, when we had the, the second last North American show, the last US show organized by uh, Al. Al was in good shape then. And uh, okay, it's me on there, and Jochen will come later this afternoon, and you see Marcel, and now I use, I want to show you something. most important software. Okay. There's a, a funny tool. Where <laughs> <I'm> 
and it was really a, a catastrophe for us. Nobody died, okay, but the damage to buildings and property was uh, enormous. Okay, so as I said, almost paradise. <laughs> Good. What's the agenda of the first session? Um, I will do an introduction on, on, the, on the issue. Then we get the keynote by the highly, how do you say, awaited, very important persons. Then I give you an overview on the event. I uh, have a slide with uh, web resources. You get the phone numbers of uh, the, the team who helps organizing this, and that's the, the, the place where I would uh, thank uh, Marcus, John, and Lisbeth for their support. Uh, without them, the rooms would still be empty, and I would stay outside uh, uh, with a car loaded full of old computers. Then you could ask questions, and uh, that would be the first session. Okay. So, the introduction. What's that? That's for Kearsaus in uh, 1959. So, 50 years ago, there was the Verkehrshaus built. And they had the 50th anniversary this year, like Irwin will have later this year. Or you already passed? <laughs> later. <laughs> later, okay. They had rebuilt the whole site after 50 years. So, the good point at the human is it, it lasts longer. Eh? <laughs> then, what's that? First step on the moon for the anniversary. Okay. 50 years. Stones of a building, you can re renew it, you can take the bricks. 40 years, they don't even have a single take of data. It's lost. They, they tell you they have, but it's lost. They, they renewed the video footage of the landing, but not by the original tapes. They, they used highly sophisticated Macintosh software and took the old video tapes from the uh, American TV. They searched all their archives about the big tapes and they didn't find them. Maybe they are somewhere. Okay, 40 years. Then, Uncle Clive, Clive Sinclair, it was uh, 30 years ago when he presented the ZX80. Good point that Clive is, gives a name like 80. Tell people in 79 that you can buy it, but you maybe buy it in 81. <laughs> So it started early with his problems of timing. But what, what mankind got, not step on the moon, not the museum, but they got the first affordable computer for everybody. It was, and they will correct me, 99 pound. About, yeah. Which was still a lot then. In, in Swiss francs, maybe this was 400 or 500. In Dutch mark, it was maybe 600 Dutch marks. The pound is low those days, but you could afford it. All the others were 5 to 10 times more expensive. Okay. Then I show you a little bit about the early 80s. I hope this will work. The computer store. Introducing Apple II, the easy to operate home computer. Just hook it up to your TV to create dazzling color displays. Or you can balance your checkbook. Kids can teach themselves arithmetic. Or the family can invent their own pong games. The possibilities are endless. It's called Apple II, the personal computer. See it at High Technology, the computer store. Computer. This is the one. Take a home computer with 16K. Yeah, one computer with a lot of shock. This is the one. The TI Home Computer gives you more of these.